Good morning, welcome to a couple days in my life. Today is Tuesday and I'm gonna be just filming some things right now. I'm gonna be getting ready, touching up my hair. Um, I took a shower last night but I didn't wash it, just put some dry shampoo in it. So I'm gonna do my hair. I'm gonna be using the Dyson Airwrap to try to give it a bit of a blowout look. I haven't used my Airwrap in like, it's been a minute. So I'm gonna be giving it a try. Just, I saw some videos yesterday and I've kind of got inspired. So I'm gonna try to get that done. Then after that, I am gonna be doing my makeup real quick, filming a couple videos. Then just getting on with my day. My kids are sick, all three of them, so we're not going out. It's cold here in California, well, at least in my part of California. It's very chilly outside, so I, I don't wanna take my kids out. So it's just gonna be a normal day for us. Just filming a couple things and then just playing and spending time with my kids because they want to go outside. But honestly, every time I let them go outside, they just come in with a more runny nose than they left with. So I'm going to keep them inside for a couple days, at least for today. Tomorrow, maybe I'll let them go play outside, but they just, I want them to get better. <laughs> we have things to do and I need them to get better. So come along with me just to get ready quickly. Um and film these videos. So since my hair is shorter, I noticed that it is a bit harder to wrap around the uh, barrel, but I mean, it looks good. I don't mind it. bottom half done honestly I'm not mad at it I like it a lot and I love it it feels like a fresh blowout nice and soft and just fresh I'm honestly shocked I've never actually touched up my hair like this before and it honestly took me like 15 minutes to do so I am I love it today I'm gonna be getting another Dyson product in the mail I'm gonna be getting the Dyson air straight so I saw Susan Yara's uh, video on it and I was sold. I, I saw her video. I did some TikTok research and it looks like it's the product for me. I bought it kind of hoping hoping to not love it. So I kind of want to return it, but I'm kind of also hoping it is the holy grail of products. Something that I can use uh, just to quicken up my routine. I honestly dread hair wash day just because I know I'm going to be blow drying my hair. It's going to be really hot. It's going to take me a long time. I'm going to have to blow dry it then round brush it and then sh go over it with a straightener if i want it to be perfect because if i don't if i do like a lazy blowout the next day it's like i have to re-blow dry the roots and it's just a lot so i dread hair wash day so i'm hoping but kind of not but kind of yeah for this product to be the holy grail of of blowout products so that should be getting here today. I'm honestly refreshing the page all the time, hoping that it is delivered. So as soon as I get that, I will show you guys. I was doing my makeup and I got the notification. I went out looking a little funny, but who cares? I got it. Uh, let's unbox it. All right, so I'm sitting on the floor just so it'll be easier for me. Let's unbox this thing. Honestly, I'm like super excited. I've never wanted to wash my hair. <laughs> So much like right now, but I'm not gonna wash it today. I'm gonna wash it tomorrow. I'm so excited. So I'm so excited, like I said, because I'm hoping that this thing is a life changer. I've seen a lot of videos of girls using this where they have similar hair texture as mine. My hair is curly, curlier at the roots than it is on the whole strand but nonetheless curly. There we go. So. 
Ahí está. Isn't it so pretty? I saw one girl's video where she said that it was heavy, but this is not heavy. It weighs nothing. But I mean, I've also used the blow dryer and a round brush, and that is heavy. That gets heavy after a while. You know, you have to be tugging and tugging with the round brush. It gets heavy. This is not heavy. I was ripping everything apart, but then I remembered if this does not work out for me, I will be returning this. So I need to take it easy on the packaging just in case. I'm hoping I get to keep it but better safe than sorry. Comes with the instruction manual, a couple other things with this little mat. I got all that put away just in case I return it. Um, and here it is. Honestly, not that heavy. It has a very similar um, connector or, or enchufe, no sé cómo se dice, um, you know, to connect to the wall. And then, again, this thing is not heavy at all. Very, very, very weightless, I'd say. But we'll see. I will be trying it out tomorrow. And take you guys along for the, for the ride. Cross your fingers, it works. Um, it works out. I am so excited. I don't know how many times I've said that, but I am beyond excited. <laughs> So sorry if you can hear the TV in the background. I got more packages in the mail. Nothing extravagant like the Airstrait, but definitely some exciting stuff. And I just wanted to share them with you all. Starting off with a filter case. I've been using filters on my lenses and I had nowhere to put them. So I got this. Uh, this is by Moment. And it's just sort of like a soft, hard shell for my filters so that's Yay. first and then i ended up getting another filter i got this one's also by moment this is a cinebloom filter and this is for this for this lens this one is just a different percentage and a bit more of a bloom and then this one is a bit more exciting this one is from naturium again i shopped their memorial day sale i've already tried a bunch of their products out and um, i wanted to try this one that I cannot find in store. But the product I, I actually wanted to try was the Sunblock. This one, I've been wanting to try this one and I just could never get my hands on it. And I took advantage of the sale. I believe it was 20% off for Memorial Day. So many people have raved about this one. It's affordable and they say it's really good. So I cannot wait to try it out. I also picked up the Niacinamide Cleansing Jelly. I have the travel size in this product and I really, really like it. So I got the big full size. This one is really good. I have tried this one. I just wanted the big size. Next, I got the Purple Ginseng Cleansing Balm. This one I have seen at Target. I just never picked it up again took advantage of the sale i like to travel with the firm uh cleansing balms not the like the oil i usually use the tatcha cleansing gel i don't like traveling with that one because i'm scared of it spilling so i did want it something like this so i'm gonna try this one out i have not tried this one and with that i got the little spatula that is used to scoop out the product i don't know if i needed it but i like having the spatulas and it's so pretty and big. I have other ones and they're a lot smaller. So I like the size of this one. That's why I got it. And that's all I got in the mail. I think I'm going to be using these tonight just to try out for the first time. I'll do like a little uh, reel on them sharing my, my thoughts. That should be over on my Instagram. If it's not up, it'll be up soon. But yeah, I'm going to try these out tonight. I'm actually really excited. Well, I'll try this one out. I know I, I love this one, but I'll try this one out tonight. I'm going to get started on dinner almost three o'clock so i just want to have everything ready for dinner for my family today i'm making tostadas de tinga oh, yeah we're all hungry so i'm gonna be making that right now just so everybody can start eating
done. So this is just beans, cheese, sour cream, uh, the tinga, I just put a little bit on this one, some green salsa and aguacate. I just forgot the lechuga, but it's okay. Se me olvido, no pasa nada. Hmm. And I always eat on my kids' plates. These are honestly the best because when you're eating food that has like these, because it's chorea, <laughs> like it'll drip. It needs barrier, so I love these plates. I'm gonna go eat, and I'll see you guys. Yes, tomorrow. It's not even seven yet, and I already showered and did my whole morning routine. I am that excited to try out the Dyson Air Straight. So that's what I'm gonna be doing during my baby's nap. He's already um, awake, so I'm gonna go get him. I'm gonna change, go get him, and then get started on my kids' breakfast. And then as soon as he goes down for a nap, I am trying that baby out. Okay, so my baby finally went down for a nap and I am gonna be trying this out. So this is my natural texture. It is quite curly. Um, I'd say especially since I got a haircut, it seems to get curlier. Okay, so I just went ahead and uh, sectioned my hair. My hair is kind of damp because I did have it like two hours in that um, twist towel thing. And I went ahead and started setting it up, which was super easy. Um, I'm going to be using it on the wet uh, mode in the highest heat temperature and the highest fan so i believe that's 285 and fan set on high i'm gonna be like rough drying it first a tiny bit just at the roots and then going from there my biggest concern is the roots so if it does get my roots you know even 95 90 percent straight or smooth it's a keeper so let's see and we are starting at 10 45 and I know I'm going to be talking through this, so it might be longer than normal, but let's see. It is so smooth. It is so, I was gonna say straight. It is so straight and so smooth. It is so good. Like, I'm keeping this. I'm so broke now. But this is really good. Like, I can't stop touching my hair. Now, the only thing I'm gonna be looking out for is frizziness. I hope I don't get frizziness. Like, when I round brush my hair, I get a bunch of frizziness and I have to just retouch it all the next day. I'm hoping this is it. I did do the the boost, I saw a lot of people say to do the boost at the end. I also did some like cool shots just to make sure, you know, it stays nice and smooth. I'm so happy. Like, seriously, you guys have no idea how happy I am. I normally don't like my hair this smooth. So I guess that would be the con. It's like super smooth, but it's okay. I'm so happy. That took me... 30 minutes, I did have two potty breaks for my kids, so that was a couple minutes off. The first bottom half, I was getting used to how to hold the product, how to, uh, what settings to use. So I'm, I think the next time I use it, it will be a lot less. I'm going to church later on tonight with my family, 
and I'm just gonna be curling my hair like normal I'm not gonna be touching up the roots because I do want to see how they last throughout the day and I'll let you guys know how it goes Happy Thursday everyone. Today I have a dentist appointment with my kids to go to so I woke up a bit earlier to get ready and have everything ready um, so we can just have a peaceful morning and I wanted to update you guys on my hair situation. So yesterday I blow dried it with the air straight and then I just touched up the ends with some curls and that was it and it was like just quick curls so it was just a slight bend I didn't have to touch up the roots like I usually have to with the curling iron it was just easy curls and not the door because I only had 10 minutes and then I just went to sleep once I got home I, I went to sleep I didn't put anything in my hair I usually do dry shampoo at night but last night I was very tired so I forgot so this morning right before I started combing through my hair I did apply some dry shampoo and I noticed that my roots were pretty smooth they were honestly they were smoother than they usually are. Like usually when I go to sleep, I wake up with like these funky looking roots that I have to smooth out all over again. Not today. There was only like a slight bend to my root. But even then, I didn't touch them up. And you can see how my hair still looks very smooth. It feels very soft. I'm not going to touch it up. Like the, even the curls that were left from yesterday it's just like a slight bend i'm just gonna leave it like that usually my curls hold up really well but i think since the air straight just smoothed my hair like too good they're just like like this there's just a slight bend usually i can wake up with actual like curls from the day before and i'm good to go not today there's just a slight bend which i'm gonna be keeping this is gonna be my hair for today and i'm okay with this I was thinking about traveling with this product and I'm honestly so excited because when I travel I usually have to take a blow dryer because I, I don't like the hotel blow dryers. I have to take a round brush or I have to take my big uh, Hot Tools round brush which is very bulky and I hate traveling in with it because it, it pokes into things. So now with the air straight since it closes very flat I can just lay it on top. I don't need a round brush. All I need is that thing and my curling iron and I'm set to go and this will save so much space in my luggage so I'm very excited to have this to be a part of my routine and next video I think I'm just gonna do a quick run through like no talking just blow drying to see how long it takes me to get a smooth finish so be on the lookout for that I think it'll be like a short or something on here on YouTube or on Instagram I'm going to go get things ready uh, with my diaper bag and my kids so we can head out and hopefully have a smooth dentist appointment for my kids. So when my kids have to go get watched at my mom's house, they always go with this 30 days tote bag. Honestly, it's the best thing. I have two of them and it's been the best decision since because it has one side pocket for bottles and then a couple pockets inside and then it has a top zipper. So I just put in extra clothes, snacks, and a bunch of stuff for, uh, in this case, it'll just be my baby. And then all I have to take is a crossbody bag and I'm good to go. Hey everyone, happy Friday. So I just wanted to come on here and yeah, I have my baby with me. He's doing his bath time. So excuse all the splashing sounds. But I wanted to come on here and do a quick update on the air straight. So I blow dried my hair on Wednesday and I'm going to be washing again on Saturdays. I wash my hair Wednesdays and Saturdays. So this morning I woke up. I honestly didn't even look at my hair. I just put it up in this claw clip and did a quick workout so i've had my hair like this since wednesday so it's been wednesday thursday friday and tomorrow i will wash it and i always wash it on saturdays just to prep it for sunday and then the beginning of the week and then i do it on either wednesday or thursday but anyways here's my hair i honestly have not even looked at it 
So I'm curious to know they're still smooth. That Wednesday night, I just curled my ends a bit. Um, but other than that, nothing else. And I am still impressed. The only thing I have to touch up is like right here because it seems to have a bend. But I think that is because I was wearing a uh, like a headband while I was working out. But other than that, it looks pretty good. I am feeling like a bit of, like right here you can see, a bit of a curl going on here. But this would usually happen on the first night, so Wednesday night, if I if I would have blow dried my hair with a round brush and a blow dryer or my big um, round brush, this would have happened and worse on the first night. It does not look that frizzy. I don't think so, at least. So yeah, I honestly think it's a game changer. I am very happy that this works. I think for my next vlog, I'm gonna be doing a couple days in my life with the air straight. Um, I, I'm gonna be showing you the whole process, like how long it takes me to actually blow dry my hair with the product with no pauses in between. I'm gonna try to get that done um, hopefully tomorrow and I will be uploading it next week. But other than that, I think that's the only update I wanted to give you guys. Today has been a very normal day. We have been home. I woke up, worked out, did some computer things. Hi, baby. Spent time with my kids. Cooked and cleaned. That's honestly my life. So I'm just going to go ahead and say bye, and I'll see you in the next vlog.